What's up guys and welcome back to Ivan's Alignment. Today we're here at Top Secret Import Tuning Shop in Newark, New Jersey. What we're gonna do is what I haven't done. You know we swapped the engine to a 2.5, we did an intake, we did headers, we put a Ver Versa tuner in it, and it's tuned by Brian from Fab9. Now, did we ever dyno it? No. We just threw a file in there, he looked at it, he said, Ivan, you're good. Now, out of all this time, I said, you know what, I'm curious. I'm really curious to know how much power this thing makes. And the reason I'm so curious is because the other day I went out with another Miata NC, just like mine, with a 2.0, and I felt like I couldn't catch him. I don't know. So I'm gonna figure out, is it, are we missing power? Or are we running rich? Or are we, I just wanna figure out what the hell happened. Or maybe that NC Miata just had some work on it. Maybe it had some camps. I don't know, I didn't even ask the guy. But I was like, damn, for a 2.0, that's pretty fast. Therefore, I'm like, you know what? Let me get some dyno numbers. Let me get some baseline numbers. And of course, I'm here with my boy, Paul. What's going on? Paul, how's everything, Paul? Good, good. How do you like my Miata, Paul? I love it, I love it. Sorry I didn't bring the RX-7. It's probably disappointing you right now. But this is different. And by the way, guys, this is Marco's brother, Paul, which we keep inviting to the track. As you see, he has a million toys here and engines. Paul, why are you scared to come into the track with us? Not scared, it's just time, yeah, time, that's it. Because you know you're gonna get smoked by us. That's what it is. Probably not, but. Probably not. Probably not. By the way, Paul also has a Porsche, which we are recommending for him to sell it since he doesn't use it properly. <laughs> <laughs> But let's see what this thing is making. <laughs> let's see. I am hoping, I am hoping at least 180, Paul. At least. 180? At a minimum. 180. If I get 180 to the wheels, I'm going to be very happy. If I get less than that, I think I'm going to be disappointed. So we're going to go ahead and I'll back this thing up, strap it up, <laughs> and, uh, and get ready. Let's see uh, what happens. All right, guys, so we got the car strapped down. We got the O2 sensor connected to the tailpipe, calibrating the machine so we could read our, the torque ratio on it and right down. Paul, are you excited? Yeah, I want to see what it makes now. <laughs> Yeah, we're always looking for, we're always, uh, usually I bring a car here with big power, right? We're talking about anywhere from. This is big power right this here. This is big power, oh man. So I'm actually curious, I am so curious to see what this actually makes. I mean, it's a fun car, it's not the most powerful car. I mean, I am gonna boost it though, I'll tell you that. Oh man, let me. Yeah, right now, let me just We just made the first dyno pool. This is how much power and torque we made. 159, 170. Obviously, we just called the tuner, let him know. He's like, Ivan, let me do a few little things here. You are missing some power. Air fuel wise, we are like at 14.2 all the way. This is a 2.5 intake headers. I mean, obviously, I'm expected to make a little more power on 93. I knew that Miata that I was playing with the other day 
I knew some. I, I knew I was messy with power. I just knew it. The torque is there, but the power. I, I just. I don't know why. I just felt it. Paul, how much more you think we're gonna get out of this? Another fifteen twenty. Another fifteen twenty. I think another fifteen twenty is a fair field, right? So we got Brian from Fab Nine through Team Viewer playing with it. So we're actually happy that we somehow got Brian to pick up the phone and say, hey, I, I got you. So we're waiting for him to finish. As soon as he's done with doing his thing there, we're gonna run it back and see what happens. All right, guys. So Brian just texted us, let's rip it. Hopefully this laptop shouldn't fly out. Hold on. Here, open the door a minute, Paul. Uh, hold the laptop. All right, here we go. Round two. See what happens. Oh, okay. We're doing better. We got 164 now. Okay, 174 torque. I don't know if anybody can see that graph properly, but okay. So we gained uh, five more horsepower. <laughs> I think we're gonna get there, little by little. What do you think, Paul? No, we're getting there. We're getting there. All right. Where is he on right now? Yeah. Oh, he is on right now. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure he's probably data logging it right there I'm sure he's gonna tell us rip it again. So uh, we're improving. We are improving guys and improvement is what you want <laughs> So let's see on on our third hit where we get at So after a few logs and a few passes, um, we know the O2 sensor is bad and we know the car is running very lean. So we're, we are gonna go ahead and fix the O2 sensor. We are gonna send them um, a data log with the O2 sensor on. And uh, hopefully when we come back, we're able to find the power that is missing. So stay tuned guys. That's all I can say, stay tuned. Am I happy? No, but this is racing. This is uh, building stuff, right? It's part of it. Anyways, guys, stay tuned. We'll be back at it. Let's see what happens.